Hey you guys, so Ellie is back and we skipped the fill. Let's get right to Peyton. She did show me an inspiration picture, which I forgot to show you a clip of, but I looked at it once and I'm not going to look at it again because I have to, I wanted to take that and just kind of, you know, do my thing with it. But basically it's the same thing. For the base coat, we're gonna do season beige, okay? We're gonna mat these out. And then after I mat them out, I'm going to put black on top of it to do the sweater design type thing using the clear powder. So the funny thing with black is just like when you're trying to use black glitter, it just doesn't come out the way you want it to come out. Nevertheless, this did come out nice, but hear me out. I put the design on here with the black and then I'm going to go back and I'm going to dump the clear acrylic powder on it. Okay. And then I'll tap off the excess. You'll see me doing that. However, you do not get as good as an effect. Did that come out right? You don't good as you don't get as good as an effect as you would using another color. So usually when you do the sweater design, you put the same color on top of that matte color and it just comes out beautifully, right? When you do it on the black, it doesn't really give the same effect as another color would, but it does give an effect. It gives it like a frosted, more like a frosted effect. And you might even find that you have to do it two times, um, which you can do on any sweater design. You can do the design, you can dump the powder on it, cure it, wipe off the excess, go back and do the same damn thing again. It all depends on how raised of a look that you want on that nail. So if you want more of a raised sweater look, if you will, then you're gonna need to stack the product higher, which means do multiple coats and cure in between each layer. But anyway, we did it black on here. It turned out nice. This pinky nail and the other pinky nail are both going to be diamonds, Swarovskis. I think these are SS threes, fives, and uh, sevens, I believe. Ellie brings her own stones. But here's the final look, you guys. 